Do you want to customize your Google Classroom? Well, in this video, I'm going to be showing you how to change your Google Classroom banner to customize your Google Classes. Inside of your classes, you have the ability to change your classroom banner, and this can make your classes stand out whilst also being used to display information such as dates, events, classes, meetings, teachers, resources, and more, as well as giving you the ability to create them based upon your lesson or a topic being covered at that moment, and so much more. And there are two types of banners you can choose from. You can either select a pre-existing theme that Google already has, or you can upload a photo or image you've created. So let's start off by selecting a pre-built-in one. Google have provided a myriad of different banners for you to choose from and have organized it into different topics. And if you want to choose any of these, for example, this one, all you have to do is just click on it and click select class theme at the bottom left. And now, as you can see, my banner image has been changed. But let's say you want to make it a bit more personalized and having and displaying when the students next have their virtual meeting or any resources that they'll need to prepare when homework's due in. Well, to do this, what you want to do is head on up into Google Slides or Google Drawings. And then once you've opened this up, head on up to File at the top left and then go all the way down until you see Page Setup. Make sure that you're on custom and where it says centimeters, make sure that it says pixels and the dimensions Google Classroom needs for a banner is 1000 pixels by 250 pixels. And I'll have this linked in the description box below as well as a template you can use to copy and paste. And then you can start designing your banner. You can add text boxes with information inside of them, text, images, icons, bitmojis and so much more. And then once you've finished them, like I've done with this one, head on up to File, Download, and download it as a PNG image. Then head on back into your Google Classroom page, and then head on down to the bottom right of your banner, like we did last time. But this time we want to click Upload Photo. We need to select one from our computer. For example, my example class banner here. And then the final step is to crop your banner. To do this, all you want to do is just drag this box around and then at the corner, drag it all the way out until it reaches the corner. So now that my banner has been inserted, all I need to do is just click select class theme at the bottom left. And as you can see, my banner has now been changed. So now what you want to do is watch the complete Google Classroom playlist for teachers, where we cover everything you need to know inside of Google Classroom. Thank you all so much for watching and I'll see you soon.